All right, so this is again. So so far, I think I'm just I might just leave it at weekly. Um, just because like every every Monday on the reset is really the main day. Um, and usually usually you can do you know I save all of my aether till the very end. So you see up there 170. Um, just because the way I, I mean, it probably doesn't work this way. Um, I don't know, I, you know, I haven't sat down and like studied this, um, all the way through, but my thinking is like, just attack the minimum per day to move up the minimum per day so that you're in lower tiers and you, and you fight against lower tier people in your, um, like your defenses fight against lower tier people. So you have more defense wins. That's what it is theoretically. Um. It might not actually work that way. I don't. I don't really know. Uh, but this is the way I do it. So I usually save all my stat, my aether to the end here. Um, compared to last aether raid seasons, as you can see, I'm tier 24. This this season is always uh, the worst season, the uh, Astra season. Uh, and you'll you'll see right now when you see what my Astra teams are. Um, but yeah. So this is the next season. Uh, I don't know. I might take. I might take her, but then having two dancers seems kind of dumb, but probably just going to do that. Um, let's go take a look at uh, placings and everything. So I make it to tier 27 on light season pretty consistently, um, but Astra season is a totally different story. So I get kind of shat on all the time. Uh, 24. Have I made it? I'm not entirely... I can't remember. I have to go check to see. There's no way, there's no way to see, I guess, if, since I, if I haven't recorded it, but... Yeah, it does seem like... Yeah, I don't think I've gotten to 227. I've gotten to 226 for sure, I know. Um, not always, but I've gotten there. Whether I've made it all the way to 227 on this season is... Um, I, I don't think I have. Uh-oh, I was supposed to check. So, tier 24, uh, 15... Where's my Aether? So here. So if I win 320-something... On top of that, it gets me to 600. So I might just... Yeah, if I'm lucky, I'll get tier 25. I don't think tier 26 is possible this time, which kind of sucks. Ah, stop getting out. Um, rank. So I don't even get a chair. Uh, not even salt 12. Ah, let's see. And lastly is uh, defense. So I'm not at the bottom. I used to be at the bottom a lot, uh, but then I I've spruced up my defenses. Still not since the last video, but like, I usually hang around around here somewhere. Sometimes I, I get lucky and I'm like up here somewhere, or these two, but yeah. Uh, so yeah, let's just do these. Uh, okay. So as you can see here, I'm also out of escape ladders, uh, which, you know, makes it a lot worse. Uh, so as you can see here, um, this is my Aether, or Aether Raids uh, offense team. I have, again, I have a bunch of other teams, like, like this one's just here for when Cronia is, like, available, but as you, if you saw the summoning video, you know she's not going to be ready for a long while. Um, these are just, like, other teams. Yeah, like I said, I get kind of lazy, so I just end up sticking with, sticking with this team anyway. Um, it's like, I'll build a bunch of others, like, oh, for this situation, this situation, and just don't use them anyway. Um, so as you can see, you know, this is a pretty big, uh, pretty uh, obvious reason why um, <laughs> I lose a lot in this season. It's because my CC Vantage unit uh, for this season is Felicia. Um, yeah, there's not much more to say about that. It's just uh, she's not very good. She, she's too easily um, she's just too easily killed and all that. Uh, so I'm going in with 100 anyway, because um, without doing this, it'd be three Aether Raids matches. Um, getting yeah, I don't know. I just rather. Uh, go. Unfortunately, as you can see here, I'm missing. I, I missed a pot somewhere. So, if I get the two pots this time, uh, it'll only be 90. So, both of these matches, I'm just gonna sort of half-ass them and and just uh, try to at least just try to survive, basically, because uh, there's a good chance I'll just end up dying, taking a lot of losses. Um, so basically, I'm just gonna try to survive, um, not worry about the eighth turn, just just worry about finishing the map. But yeah, we'll we'll, we'll, we'll see how this goes. Uh, another thing, let's go see here. Uh, some defense successes and all that stuff. Uh, for you playing, again, I don't know if this is if this is worthwhile. But to me, like I don't rematch these people all the time, um, just because it doesn't really matter that much. But like, it's good to. I feel like it's good to save some of these to the end. So like right now, I'm, I'm just gonna go normal, just because I'd rather do that. But like, 
This guy attacked me on day one, right? So this is when we're all in a similar bracket, when I, you're lower level. So I feel sometimes like, 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 this, I, I defeated four right here, so maybe I should attack him, rematch him, because he's probably a lower level. Uh, maybe his defense isn't very good. Um, there's a higher chance, I mean, it's not secure, right? They could, I mean, maybe most of their investments are in defense instead of offense or something like that, right? But there's a, there's a good chance that, like, you'll be fighting someone a little, a little weaker, um, by just rematching like some of the old ones or you know some people who didn't do so well like maybe not this guy right I didn't kill anybody I lost full aether but maybe like this guy up here or something like that um, but yeah I don't know I just I'd rather just do this uh, let's go see the battle yeah so here goes again it's not so interesting as last time because I'm not gonna be in tier 27 this time but. Uh, yeah, we'll just see how this. Oh wow, this is this is this is horrible. Okay, so I think right. I'm not I'm not entirely sure, but I think I might have already lost. This is a lot of physical damage. One, two, three physical damage threats. I can't kill. I won't be able to kill him. Um, she does way too much damage with this. Um, yeah, I think this is. I think this is it. I think I might have just lost already, just on a basic level. I mean, I said that last time, but yeah, I don't see myself surviving any of this. That kind of sucks. Uh, yeah, I don't have any other teams. So I'm just going with this. Uh, again, um, Colorless Micaiah makes this a little easier because uh, she has like the the true damage or whatever on her um, her whatever thing, her duo skill. Uh, however, uh, I don't think that's gonna save me here. Let's see. So these these people, forty. Okay, so this isn't affecting anybody. This is why you wanna kind of boost it. I just I don't use this tower very often. I just kind of have it here because the season asked me to use it. Um, but yeah, I don't think I think this is it. I think this is over. Um, I can't normally, like her. She can't tank her. She's got 51 res and... Hey, what the fuck? Where are these stats coming from? Oh, wow, what the... This is at level 4. Mine's at level 6! Bro! This person might be new. Wow, that, that's weird. Well, there you go, see? I get the veteran's discount or whatever. That's insane, that is a lot of stats. Oh my gosh, could you imagine? Oh, I wish I wish Felicia looked like this normally. Because I might win this. This is this is this is really strange. Um That that's a lot of stats. Now that gives this some bite. Um it'd be really funny if I still lose anyway. Uh let's see. 40 damn dude. What stats, man? 30 something stat defense here, 75 attack. I don't know, it's just really satisfying to look at these like really um, cartoonishly balloon stats. So I think, okay, so that changes like so much of this. So let's see. If I put her here, I, I really need to change her to smite. Um, she's not on smite specifically because there is no reason. She's just not on smite. I don't know why. Um, but I really do need to put that on her. So, and she's missing a seal for some reason. This should probably be something like uh, chill, like a chill defense. Why is she missing that seal? Well, there you go, that sucks. Um, yeah, so, let's see. If I put her here and I flip her up here, she can move here and then hit her. What do you have? You're chilling something. Lowest res, I don't know who that is. Stop. 51. 50. I think it's her. 46. 29. Oh, it's her. 29. Yeah, 56. Um, yeah, so this is kind of interesting. Um, oh my gosh, how could you just neglect the tower like that? That's so weird. Yeah, I think this person's new, which is kind of weird. They, they have two of these. And yeah, they don't have any merges. Oh man, this is, this is how bad I am. I've been playing this game. <laughs> since, like, 
I don't know. I want to say since day one, but I don't think I was like literally day one. But I was. I've been here for for a very long time. Um, but yeah, my my account is basically on tier with someone who just picked up the game and is lacking merges on this. That's that's just sad. Um, okay. So I want her here. I think right. Well, Thulgan and this. Maybe I want her there. If I put stand here, dance her two, and I can hit him. And I think the best thing to do would be just to have her there, have her. Um, so I'm gonna flip her here. She'll be here. It'll be her turn. She'll skip over this and stand here. So once she's here, I want her to hit her. I think. These two, they don't do much, anything outside of the weird, normal, uh... Sword, Lance, Axe, Dragonstone, or Beast Damage. So, basically she has, um, advantage against close range. I don't like this weapon, and I don't like this. So, and I also don't like this, so I think I'm just gonna hit her. Uh, he's gonna be a huge pain in the ass, but it doesn't really matter, um... Yeah, let's let's just find out how good this like hulking Felicia is. Oh my gosh, dude, this is so weird. Look at these stats. Uh, yeah. So let's let's flip you up there, put you there. Uh, she'll hit her, and then I guess theoretically, hopefully, kill these other ones. Uh, she's got fifty, so she won't be doubled. Uh, she still outspeeds him, but then I have Tamari uh, debuffing him. Uh, and then chill speed on somebody, I don't know, 48. One of the, oh. So, I heard that chill speed hits both of them, if they, let's just find out. Um, yeah, there's not much to it, so I'm just gonna activate this and all these guys here will be debuffed. Uh, let's go for it here. Okay. So, she's getting the minus 7, let's take a look at you. She is also getting the minus 7, or he is. So, yeah, if, that's just one thing you wanna take, uh, take care of if you have a team where, um, two people have the same stat and you don't want them to get chilled, have one of them, you have to offset them basically. Um, that way they both don't get hit by the chill. Cause it's better to have just one get hit by a chill than, than two. Cause then that's just basically, the second one's like free, uh, free chilling. Yeah, this is great because, um, yeah, I don't know why I was uh, trying to get that on her. So she's gonna stand here, hit, oh, actually, well, it doesn't really matter because she's gonna get the um, the dominance status effect regardless. Uh, let's see, this is over here. So you, you don't want this here because then I mean, no one's gonna come through here to hit them from here. They're gonna come through this side, which I guess is what he wants. But like, yeah, I don't know. It's just an interesting team. It's weird that uh, it's weird that I got yes. matched up with this person here. Hmm. Maybe I should. Uh, with utter certainty. Ready. Okay, so I can kill you, I can kill you without even having to trigger this. I'm gonna stand you here. Yeah, okay, cool. Gonna activate the dominance thing. I almost forgot to uh, turn on animations. Okay, so she has it on now too, so if they decide to come fight her for some reason, I mean, good luck I guess, but yeah, she should be fine. Okay. Let's come here, hit her, or hit her. Doesn't really matter, honestly, they're all just gonna die. Um, read. I don't like her because she has the panic thing, so I'm just gonna hit her. Oh, she's gonna inflict it on me anyway, I guess. 61 damage. Um, so this is basically what it's at, right? So I get this huge attack stat. I target their weakest, which is res, 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 and res. Well, so, okay, never mind. That was worthless. Um, but yeah. I mean, 
Th there's no strategy here. Like, I think anything would have won. Would have probably um, had me win, which is kind of funny. But yeah, I mean, you know, whatever. Uh, let's just end the turn. I think they're all just going to die on her. Okay, let's see what you do. 22 damage. Okay, and then I get to heal on this next one. So I think she's just maxing. Oh, okay, no, she's not. 18. And then I get the 63. Yeah, I think, yeah. Everybody's just gonna die. And I get Vantage. Oh man, why can't I have these stats all the time? Let's see. So can I kill him now? I, I still can kill him. Okay. Well, he doesn't also he also doesn't have any uh, teammates, so it's. I feel like I just want to I just want to take these just because. Um. Yeah, there's no reason to waste time. Let's just kill him. Yeah. So the fortress mechanic won me that game. It's a weird mechanic. Uh, it only serves to uh, keep new people down. Because they're not going to have all the, like, not only do they have to upgrade the the fortresses and all that, they have to upgrade um, the, the fortress in the middle and all their buildings need to be to a significant level, like, so one got me there. So we'll do one more for 50. I want to go see, can I make it to, let's we'll see where I'm at now. So at least I get a chair, I think, yeah, I'm pretty sure. Um, I have 70 something. I don't think I'll be able to. What do I need? I need what? So, 8. Here it gives me 37. 78. 78 here gives me um, 800. 278. Yeah, I don't think so. So, let's take a look here. So, 162. Yeah. So, I guess uh, this one's just sort of just doing it just to do it, I guess. Um, Let's go in there and see who I fight. See how I find someone with like a... Yeah, that, that, that's like a 3-4 difference. Okay, let's check them out. That team that I fought last time... Um, I don't have one right now, but I think what would have been pretty good might have been like... A, some sort of Gale Force uh, team. All those were very weak, which means that... You could have just killed one and killed the second one, and then the last two would have been left there. Um, been pretty weakened. Yeah, I don't know. I don't have a like I said. I don't have a Guild Force team. I'm not used to how Guild Force teams work. Uh, so let's take a look at this board again. Plus one. Okay. So I can't cheese it this time. Using uh, bullshit mechanics. Let's see. Plus ten Nasala. That's not. That's not bad. That's kind of interesting. This one. The Bramimond is here, and he's just... Yeah. I mean, you're not allowed to say anything in this game is broken, right? But, I mean... Who honestly likes fighting against uh, Bramimond or... Or, uh... Or Ilfinger, what's her name? Thrasir, or life people with overloaded skill sets what to do what to do so she's oh okay never mind i was thinking cause, um bulky during light season has uh, close foil um but yeah so this is anima season this person doesn't have two um doesn't have their two seasons set up Man, this is bad. I'm being matched up against people who don't even know what they're doing, um, and I'm losing. Is the it's what it's what bothers me. Um, so normally, I think I would have made it to 26, but earlier this week I burned. I think it might have been actually yesterday. Uh, days are blurring together very weirdly. Um, yeah, like at some point, I think yesterday. This is this is a good choice on him. They give this to to Barn, but I think Nasala makes better use of it. Um, 
Yeah, he already comes with good res and, and boosting up his defense a little bit. Oh, shut up. Boosting up his defense a little bit um, is always helpful, especially if he's going to be running into people all the time. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I don't think I can survive this. He hits me, and foe cannot make a follow-up attack. So I think the, the person to, to put here to probably bait her or him is going to be her, but whether she has the res to survive, or the defense to survive something like that, uh, who knows. So he's going to hit me 52. I've only got 38 uh, defense. This is, a, this is a tricky team. I'll give them that. Um, I guess immediately the, the main thing I want to do is... Uh, Devil Axe, what does this do? Okay, so he gets... He takes 12 damage, but he gets... 8 to all his stats. What are you looking like? Yeah, you're still kind of res weak. Uh, that's, a, that's, that's a good amount of um, attack. Yeah, that's an interesting build you got here. Um, okay, so he, he does plus 20 when ruptured sky. So I'm not going to put my dragon there. Obviously, there's no reason to because my dragon's Naga. Um, but... I might have to hit him with uh, Felicia? I don't know. This is weird. Uh, let me see. This Nesala is just a huge pain in the ass. He's got three movement and there's a dancer back there, so... There's not much I can do to stop him if he wants to just, like, stomp on me. 47 speed. 34 res. He's got, he's even got Heavy Blade thing over there. Um, what should I do, what should I do? Yeah, this is looking like I don't have the proper team for this. Now, I haven't used Cronia, right? I don't have uh, her, her maxed out, but just like on a theoretical level, I think she might have done a little bit better here. The fact that they're all protecting that healing tower kind of makes it a huge pain. I mean, let's see. You might like put her here. Hopefully, you trigger this and then dance her in some way. Put her here, or like smite her here and then hit him or her, one of them. Hopefully, she kills them. Which, yeah, looking at either of them, I don't think even Cronia would have killed them. But theoretically, you probably put her here, kill this one, then uh, move her here to, to snipe this tower. But, yeah, like I said, people are, are getting better at like moving, at keeping their healing tower on lock. So I think in general, I might just, I'm probably just going to lose this. Um, if I pop this and then have someone sit here, what would happen? She would attack, he would attack. One, two, three, here. They could attack here and here. Problem is the dancer, too. Let's see, what if I... I can't do that. If I hit this... Yeah, let's try this. So if I hit this... Let's flip you up here. She stands here and hits her. Okay, so I think in this case I don't need my um, dancer. So let's see. Let's hit this. Come here. Flip her up here. Have her stand here. Try to hit her. I mean, she probably might not kill her. What are you at? Actually, yeah, she might not kill her. I mean, she probably. Oh no, I think she might. Yeah, she might kill her. Um, well, she might not kill her, just what I was what was going through my brain was, um, this might stop me here. Um, uh, 
The thing is, the only th the thing that'll probably give me, um, that'll let me... Yeah, her, her dual skill is the only thing that might give me a chance here. But even then, it's like, I'm probably just gonna die. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna trigger this, see if it's a trap or not, and then make a move from there. Like, trigger this, dance her, and then have her um, flip her back here. I think that's, yeah, that's a good... Okay, so it was a trap. Okay. Can I kill you? Nope. Uh, this... See, th this is the thing that bothers me the most, is this thing here. Like this? Yeah, whatever. I can take or leave it. This is whatever. This, obviously, don't care. All the ridiculous nonsense, his, um... Like, all this right here, this, this, no, this is, like, you're gonna sit here and tell me this isn't, this is balanced. But whatever. Um, but this is the one thing that, that annoys me. Um, so let's see, I can't do that. Hmm. Let's put you here, trigger that there. Yeah, because she's the only one. The, only, the, the, the biggest problem is he is going to come over here and hit her. One, two, three, here, and then hit her anyway. But I think, uh, here, here's a, here's an idea. I'm going to put you here, right? We'll activate the dual skill here. Okay, I think I'm gonna put you here. The hardy bearing user's out of the way. He's gonna come down and hit me, but I'm gonna hit him before, so he's at minus five, five, seven, and seven. Okay, I think this is looking good. I think this is looking good. Um, okay. So at this point, I can just kill anybody, really. Uh, you're gonna die, 80 damage. Ready. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this here. Um, so one shot. She's in vantage range. Um, he's at 55. Yeah, so. Consider it done. Not much more here to do than to just let it play out, I guess. Let's see what happens. Okay. Okay, so she's gonna die. Cool, cool. I think... I'm not sure why this one attacks first, because I feel like this guy over here should attack first. There you go, and then I'm reducing his, um... See, I knew it was a good idea to put Pulse Smoke on her. I was totally, like, that's what I was... Yeah, that's what I had in mind the whole time. And he's dead. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I won this. I mean, I won this off of Broadleaf Fan, which... <sighs> goes to show you how powerful Broadleaf Fan is. Um, so, uh, for those of you out there, uh, remember, Broadleaf Fan. Pick it up. Um, so here's where we, it gets kind of fishy. I think I'm going to do this. Dancer. Ugh, this tile here. Oh, it was fake. Called it. Okay, so I think that now I'm gonna dance her. Let's go together. Consider it done. See if I do this here. It will be done. Well Certainly. I need to I need to pop this so I can flip her here and then have her kill her. Because I do need to dance her. Okay, cool, there we go. That's, that's what was, okay. Let's, let's do this. Together. Well, let's take a look at this first. Yeah, okay, he's gonna die. Uh, okay, cool. Wow, I can't believe I won this. This is ridiculous. This broadly fan effect is... This is why I was saying last time. It's like, I feel like I might just, like, find some way. I need to make one team where she's on every, like... I need to have her available no matter what season it is. So I'll have to, like, find a team where maybe I take the dancer off and then leave, uh... The duo Mikaya here, um, just because that broadleaf fan effect is broken. Um, but I'm probably gonna do that on light season because I'm waiting for it to come back and it hasn't come back, so I'm saving orbs. Um, but I really need that broadleaf fan uh, banner to come back because 
it's just broken. Um, yeah, so I don't have to worry about her on this team, but on, on Light, I need to figure out a way, a way to fit her in there because having spent Thrift Bow with the Broadleaf fan effect on it, it it's it, no, it's that's ridiculous, that's just dumb. Um, but yeah, so let's kill you. And let's kill you. So one and a two. Twenty-eight. Oh, that's right. I forgot. I was like, well, I mean, I was hoping she'd kill her anyway. But the reason I wanted her specifically there <laughs> was because um, she has the dragon effectiveness. But I forgot that Sublime Surge uh, removes the dragon effectiveness. So there you go. Um, a pretty clutch move played my uh, played my eyes out there um, but uh, we couldn't secure the uh, any higher than we are now so which is alright um, like I said my Astra season is by far the weakest season um, as you can see I'm running around with Felicia um, but I mean yeah she's I've done fairly well given her I think like I said all I need is the uh, Broadleaf fan and uh, I can't even see my teams. All I need is a Broadly fan, and I think I'll definitely have a little more success going forward. Um, yeah, because it's a Broadly fan with Tamari, and then the fact that she has um, a dagger, well, well, the fact that it is a dagger and debuffs, that's already uh, that 10 plus 14. It's already 24, basically 24 true damage per attack. I don't know if Broadly fan works as true damage. I think it adds it to your attack. Which, I mean, either way, is it, decent, right? Like, but yeah, um, but yeah, that, that's it for this season, I guess. Uh, good luck on uh, all of your guys' season, seasonal stuff out there.